Welcome or welcome back to Y Gaming. Today we are back with some more Night of the Dead. And what we are doing in today's episode is pretty simple. We are looking for the skill books. Now, if you don't know, skill books are pretty important to actually progress in the game. And at the time of recording this video, there is 11 books currently in game. Five of those are set world spawns so they spawn in set locations and the other six are random lootable items which you can get from bookshelves what we're going to do first off is go through the five set spawns and then afterwards i'll show you a little trick to get the other six a little bit quicker our first location is the central hospital <clears throat> clue is in the name it is in the center of the actual map and it is right here at 14 and 15 or 1414 if you come straight into the main city it is one of the first buildings you will see now this book is pretty damn simple straight in the main front entrance all the way up to the uh, first and second floor straight over to the reception desk here and if you look just around this corner you will find your first book which we uh, we can't pick up for some reason no. There we go. That is Quantum Physics 4 Materials. Now, luckily, uh, the majority of these books are all in the city vicinity. So once you start at the hospital, it's a pretty simple procedure. Let's move on and get book number two. For the next part, we are after book number two, which is the Encyclopedia of Ammunition. Very easy to get to. It is just a little bit down the road from the hospital there. We started just there. Come out of that main door, go left and follow the road, and you will come across the police station. It is all walled in. It's pretty easy to see. And all you've got to do is go straight through this main door. There are a couple of ferals in this location, though, so you, you definitely want to bring a little bit of ammo and straight through that door and straight through this door and then into the reception area as you come into the reception area on the left hand side you will see it just there sitting on the desk next to the giant chair and also the giant desk very strange um, sizes in this game next up we are at the church for the internal combustion engines book this one is very very small as you can see, we're not too far from the police station. Come straight out of the police station, hit a left, go all the way down the road there, and it is just on your right-hand side. It's a pretty um, pretty obvious building, really. Um, there's no walls around it, and it's the only church that I've actually come across, so pretty easy to find. But once you've come in here, head all the way back to the back of the uh, church, and it is just on the altar there next to the Bible. For the next book, we are at the school, which is a pretty big building just on the outskirts of the city. If you come out of the church where we just were, which is just here, you can pretty much do a straight line, cut through this alleyway here, and then there's a bunch of bushes there. You will come across a big black fence here and just follow that round until you come to the road. And then there's a little cut through, which I'll show you in just a second. Now this one only has it's got one big butcher so it's not really too much of a, a difficult challenge and there's not really many other zombies here unless you're playing on uh, obviously legend mode and you've got the spawn set all the way up but you come in obviously on the right hand side there you can jump through the really annoying thing about this gate is you can't actually shoot through it which is a pain in the ass you go in through the main door straight up the stairs here Top of the stairs, hit a right. Head to the door on the left hand side, go straight in past the bookshelves, go all the way down, and then just the one before the end that is organic electronic materials. Now, also, these buildings that we are heading into, quite a few of them do have the end game materials in them, so the radio and stuff like that, if you don't know. Um, if you've not actually got to that point or you don't know that it exists, I will link the video to the guides uh, that I've done on that in the description down below. Now for our fifth and final book, we are at the Science Research Center for the polymer something. The name is completely gone, but this one is a pretty easy location too, and it is just out of the city. So the hospital is just here, uh, the school is there, police station's there, church is there, 
but you just come off the hospital and just follow the main road all the way down until you come across your first left-hand turn. Take that turn, follow the road, and you will see a big set of stairs like this. And at the top of those stairs, you are at the science center. The chimney stack there is a pretty dead giveaway. You can see that from quite far away. Uh, there's a big mountain that side as well, which separates the city from this sort of road. So if you do go up the mountain, you can see it pretty easy. Now, in here is normally a lot of zombies and also a butcher, but that's fine. We will deal with it. Now, follow it all the way through to the back end here. Uh, come through to the left-hand side, then the door on the right, up the stairs, go all the way around. Just follow it till you're in the main corridor. Go all the way down to the back, and then over here by the scales, here is our book. Bish, bash, and a bosh. That is all five set book locations. Now let's talk about the other six. So, for our last six skill books, they are pretty easy to get. Normally, by the time you're going after the last five, you've already got these six. Um, that is, like I said, because they are pretty damn simple. All you've got to do to get these things is just play the game as you would normally. You're going to be wandering around. Every house that you search possibly has one of these bookshelves in. Uh, same as some of the POIs and even some of the shops. So just keep your eyes open for them. They are obviously a little bit different to the random set piece bookshelves that you will come across because those ones are much more decorative and have a lot more on and they don't shine white like this when you get close to them. Now, obviously these are, they are the same color, but they are, like I said, a little bit smaller and they don't have as much on them. Now, all you've got to do is search one of these bad boys and oh, there we go. I am playing on easy just because I've got a little series of playthroughs like this going where I'm going to do um, tips and tricks. So it's just a bit easier to get the bits together. Um, but yeah, we did come across these. But if you are playing on a harder difficulty, you may not actually get anything from them. Now, what you do want to do is search it, take all. But before you do it, save the game. Now, create a new save file. Uh, let's go just with that one. Um, TST, save, and bish bash bosh. Now, what you can do is this one, loot this, we'll take all, but, oh no, there was actually nothing in there. So, now what we're going to do is go back over to that one and reload the save. That will bring back the bookshelf and potentially some books on there if you didn't actually get them. Like I said, these things are easy to find and more than likely you would have found them by the time you actually go after the last five books anyway. Let's load, and there's our bookshelf. What have we got in this one? Same books anyway. Nice. We've got more books. So I hope this has helped you. If it has, please drop a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, and stick around, because we'll be doing much more guides like this on Night of the Dead. We are still waiting eagerly for the next update, which will introduce a whole host of new biomes and zombies, and also, finally, vehicles. Very excited for that one. So stick around if that is something that you are interested in, as well as the game Night of the Dead, because we cover it in full here on Thursdays at 8 p.m. BST. Subscribe to the channel, drop a like on the video. For now, though, I've been Wired, you've been awesome, thanks for watching, and we'll see you very soon with someone Night of the Dead.